What is going on YouTube? Thomas coming at you with a brand new video guys and in today's video we're going to be talking about my Bing Ads case study. It is the first video of the series. I'm going to have a couple videos. I'm not sure how long it's going to be because I'm not sure how long I'm going to be running this um, campaign pretty much. How you know I'm going to kind of alter it and change it throughout the next couple of days, weeks, months, who knows. So I'm essentially guys going to show you. I've been talking about it for the you know, past few videos hinting at it what I'm doing and essentially why and how it's going to potentially make me money um, and potentially be profitable enough where I'm going to put more money back into it and continue to grow it up and make more money from it. So, okay guys, so it's essentially it's affiliate marketing funnel where I create a new domain name and I got $100 in Bing advertising credits. So I'm essentially taking the $100 and I'm going to be testing it out because I wouldn't have used Bing ads in the first place. Um, Bing ads generally is a advertising platform for the older generation, people who have not been switching over to Google. Uh, I think Bing is MSN, Yahoo, Bing, like all those are kind of all in, in one. It, that's where the ads are shown. So it's, it's just like Google ads. It's essentially the same type of thing. It's just like you can make search ads. Um, I believe you can make kind of like picture ads as well. So what I've done, guys, is essentially um, I have a get response uh, account. And I use GetResponse as my autoresponder. I create landing pages from that for now. Uh, it's 15 bucks after the free trial of 30 days, $15 per month for up to 1,000 subscribers. And then it's $15 additionally for the landing page features that I want. So it's 30 bucks a month. Would I currently pay for it as I'm testing it out to see how I want to, if I want to continue with it? So what I have here, guys, is a little bit of a the, the early stages of my campaign. I'm going to minimize myself a little bit more. So you guys can see a little bit more here. But essentially, if you guys don't, uh, if you're not familiar, this is a ClickBank product. ClickBank U, it's like a ClickBank University. It essentially is like a, a info product, I believe, where you go through, they teach you how to use ClickBank, how to make money with ClickBank. And it's like subscription-based, I think, um, reoccurring type of thing. So people can sign up to be a member. Um, and essentially, I get a commission off that if they sign up for my link. So what I have, guys, is a simple funnel setup. So I have a Bing ad set up. I will actually literally show you the ad. I literally am testing these out. So this is the early, I literally started these a couple days ago, uh, early, early stages of the ad. And um, there's going to be much more optimization and further you know, changes being made. But for what I have right now, I'll show you guys my keywords actually. So essentially I have keywords of, you know, related to ClickBank, which would make sense for someone searching for ClickBank. Maybe they're searching for, you know, ClickBank. Oh, oh yeah, like how do you make money with ClickBank? Boom. So my keywords are ClickBank, part-time, work from home, make money from home, make money fast, affiliates, ClickBank University 2.0. If you guys notice that that is a 50% CTR, which is pretty good because it's literally the product um, that <coughs> if they opt into the page, they go to that product. So it's like very, very highly related. Learn affiliate marketing because it's about affiliate marketing through ClickBank. If ClickBank University will teach them how to affiliate market. ClickBank Affiliate and ClickBank University, right? So essentially, guys, that is all my have for keywords. I'm, you know, spending fairly low cost per clicks, 62, 60 cents, 65. Some of these are below first page bids. I have not really got, I'm going to let them gather a little more data before I start upping the bids and stuff. Um, so I'm going to see what happens. But essentially, guys, what I'm averaging right now, just under 30 bucks spent on the campaign. Um, and Let's see if it shows on the bottom somewhere. If I move over, let's see. Yeah, so this this campaign for ClickBank University, I spent twenty two eighty one, and a different campaign, I spent a couple more bucks, but I canceled that one quickly because this one was per performing better. So might as well put all you know more money into this one. So essentially, that's what I'm I'm looking at right now. I'll move myself to the left here, and what I have these people going from from the actual um, ad on Bing to a landing page. That is similar to one of these, and I'm gonna just gonna open this one. I'm not gonna show you my exact landing page. This is the one that I've been testing out um, for now. So I'm gonna open this guy up really quick. Actually, this is not how you want to do it. I want to open up the actual page, not the editor. So one sec here. I'm gonna open the actual landing page to show you guys what people are coming from Bing to, essentially. Okay, here it is. So this is what the URL is for now. I haven't change anything 
So it says how to free training reveals how to earn a seven figure side income online. In this free training, you'll learn how to create your own internet business from scratch, how to make money with affiliate marketing, how to earn a seven figure passive income. Uh, sorry about that. And they enter their name. They don't have to do that. They enter their email and they get their free training. So this background is not great. The page is really not optimized. This is just like a test page that I kind of made. So essentially all I really want is this piece right here, people to see, enter their email. Then what happens is, let me just enter an email right here. Um, let's see. I don't know if this is even a real email. <laughs> so they'll click this button. So come from Bing. It'll say something like, check out this free training video or you want a free training on how to learn. And if you guys also are familiar, this is a ClickBank product right here. I think it's John Gristani. He's a pretty experienced affiliate marketer. He's done pretty well for himself. And here's what his, essentially, this is a huge high ticket offer, right? So this is the page that they come to. So now I have their email and here's the free training, right? So I give them the free training, they're into their email for you, right? But then the free training essentially sells um, the product on the back on the you know the back end which I would then get a commission for I think it's like a thousand dollar product so I get like four hundred bucks or something like that so it's, it's a big commission but the key here guys is that I got the email so I got the person's email from the opt-in and then what I do is I actually have an autoresponder set up so let me go to email marketing let me go to autoresponders and I'm gonna literally show you um, so here I have the, this campaign Bing affiliate marketing and I have the all these autoresponders kind of set up um, going through this this rate is actually pretty these are pretty bad rates right now guys so <clears throat> a lot of this is just testing and I'm gonna be optimizing as I go so now I'm gonna go figure out how do I get this to go higher how do I you know decrease the spam um, count how do I get people to, to uh, opt in a lot of these actually is me testing I had like three emails that I tested so this is why it might be pretty low here but um, essentially you know that's what you want to do and now you let these people run through your autoresponder to see if they in fact do maybe listen to what you have to say you provide them value I have a bunch of days I have like 15 days provide them a ton of value and then you sell them as well so I have you know three value emails and then I will have a sales email so essentially what I'm gonna do guys is hopefully make some money on the back end if someone buys something through one of these emails going forward or if they buy off the top off the front end even better right so then I can reinvest that money back in it's free essentially guys so Bing, <clears throat> um, I got the credit, so I might as well use it. But now what I'm realizing is this, is I had this credit, which is great, but the problem that I have is that Bing is generally an older audience, right? And the stuff that I'm promoting, some older people may be interested in it, but I don't think I'm gonna be seeing the best numbers with Bing. So I want to test this funnel out with Bing for now. I'm gonna test like, 40 50 bucks and then stop and see what what you know if I got any results if not what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually um, maybe I'll make it um, I'll, I'll change some things to see what what was working what's not and actually it's funny I just got a, a subscriber to the list right there um, just now but um, it, I'm gonna change some things around change some um, titles uh, subject lines all that type of stuff so and, you know make sure and there's no spelling errors in any of my stuff and then maybe start getting traffic, driving traffic from somewhere else, right? Somewhere else, drive, and maybe also on top of that, giving them a free offer to make that sign up a little more convincing instead of getting like a 20% opt-in rate or whatever I was getting. Maybe I'll get that up to 30 to 40% even higher with a free bonus as well as the free training. So that's what I'm kind of doing right now, guys. Uh, I have only spent like 25, 30 bucks. Nothing, no, no sales in return as of yet. It's only been a few days. Uh, and I'll continue to update you guys in the future. This is the first video of this little mini series that I'm gonna be talking about, and I might actually make different types because I might use this same funnel, but now try Facebook traffic, and maybe try a little bit of a younger generation, and I might also try solo ads. I might try Google ads, right, and I'll see what works best, and then maybe go, go all in on that, right? So that's kind of the name of the game, kind of testing and seeing what works best, guys. But that is it for this video. I will, guys, please subscribe to the channel if you wanna see the next video from this little mini series. Um, it'll be out in a couple days once I get a little more data. Maybe if I get a sale, I'll let you guys know for sure. And uh, stay tuned to the channel, guys. Like this video if you thought it was helpful, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.